Hello YouTube. Today we have a bit of something a little bit different than normal court. Here we have my 1993 Jeep Grand Wagoneer. It's just going to be a walk around, no engine starting because the fuel filter went on it. So it won't start. It's just leaking gas. So start here with the boot, and the trunk, depending on where you're from. It even has its OEM cargo cover. It's, ignore the mess. It was disgusting when I got it. But cleaned it out. Has some stuff on the other side. Storage. I just woke up. So, you know, I've got some rest issues on it. Shake this underneath of it. It's not in too bad of shape. I'll go ahead and unlock. I forgot to lock this. I have to replace this handle. But here we have the driver's side. Go ahead and pop open the door here. Once I find the lock. Right. Here's the back seat folds down. I have a pressure washer here, some trim that we took off. Here's a new rear left fuel filter and the Permatex mirror kit. The interior on this car is mint. Be nice and minty. Look at this condition. Now yeah, for the part a lot of you are probably looking for. Kind of not all that desirable. But I'm only a Jeep community, but it's what I like. I'm gonna find it here. Okay, this Jeep doesn't have an inline six. This one has a big old V8 in it. American Muscle in a Jeep. <laughs> now I'm gonna go over to the passenger side here. Yeah, black black my head on that sometimes. But um, go ahead and you unlock it because, like I said. Don't have the battery hooked up or it's dead. Oh, it's just dead. Battery's right there, but it's completely dead. We tried charging yesterday. Shot. I don't have